One of the best ways to start understanding the Internet of Things is to think of it as adding intelligence where there previously wasn't any. We can now inexpensively embed sensors and radios into products such as lighting fixtures or kitchen appliances or bicycles and enable them to communicate with other devices or smartphones or simply send collected information into the cloud. Our product designers work with Intellidyne, which is a company that helps reduce energy consumption. Their products attached to heating, refrigeration, and air conditioning units. We've recently helped them add IoT technology to their products. This provides Intel 9 with access to critical data, including fuel savings, configuration information, and more. A great example of the benefits of connecting your product to the internet can be found in AdhereTech's new smart pill bottle. It issues notifications when it's time for the medication to be taken. It alerts the patient and healthcare providers when a dose has been missed and it stores data in the cloud that protects the privacy of the patients, but over time provides important information about medication adherence to the healthcare providers and pharmaceutical companies. A big question is if things and systems are more and more connected, is it impossible that one hack can disrupt an entire system? The short answer is yes, but the security industry is on top of the upswing in IoT technology and is producing products necessary to protect the property of individuals and business assets. We're experiencing is a perfect storm in IoT. The value proposition enablers are uh, becoming available. There's cost for new technology sensors and powerful microprocessors that are dropping. Wireless bandwidth is uh, much more ubiquitous and inexpensive. Data storage costs are down. With these enablers, the value of connected devices are being recognized by consumers. When a company invests in the Internet of Things, they can expand into new businesses fairly rapidly and build new and recurring revenue streams at a relatively low cost. Rather than simply providing a product, firms can collect and sell a host of data related to that product, including sales patterns, customer demographics, and business analytics. 